Welcome back to a new episode of TBH. I'm your host, Jay Spesh, creator, director, and founder of the Beer It's Craft Beer Apparel Line. Let's get into today's episode. We're checking out another beer from Cantillon. Now, this is going to be their 5% ABV Raspberry Lambic. Their one and only, if you say it in English, Rose de Gambrinus, or if you're going to say it in the French way, Rose de Gambrinus. Let's get this into a glass, and I'll let you know what I think of this one. reminds me just like their creek lambic the only difference on this one i'm getting more of the sweet sweeter uh, raspberry notes on this um so you're definitely getting just to me rose petals um, um that 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 violet rose petal big raspberry sweetness some tartness acidity in the nose as well that 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 soury quality um funky subtleness in there definitely getting uh, not barnyardy but almost just like um an earthy just um, dustiness and then you're just picking up all that that's that spontaneously fermentation all that open air bacteria in there um, it gives you just that, that, that unique flavor uh, that unique aroma that you just don't pick up in all these American wild ales um, it's very unique in its own classical type of way well done well perfected and just unique and complex and there's so much flavor that I just can't tell you everything <laughs> little bit more impressive than the creek this one actually has more um, tartness and more acidity on this you're picking up that just you know tart raspberry now when the aromas you're picking up a sweetness you're picking up more tart more um, kind of like lemon that lemon acidity in it raspberry um, dustiness rose petal Astringent makes you pucker up, dryness, um, almost like oaky tannic dryness in a way that dries the oaky tannin. Um, not sure if this is oak barrel or anything, but I just I picked that up in this one. Final verdict on Cantillon's Rose de Gambrinus. This is a fantastic um, Frambois Lambic or Raspberry Lambic. It's not going to be more of a sweeter type. This has a two-year-old lambic in it. It's definitely giving you more of the mature side of the lambic, where you get more of the funkier, more of the um, you know nice quality of it. But still has uh, a nice young amount of that lambic in there. That it still gives you that tart, acidy, sour quality. Um, the fruit in this, it's not going to be that type of sweetness. It's not overly sweet like these uh, Leafman's and Lindemann fruit lambics, Frambois lambics. Um, this is just going to show you a nice showcase of what um, fruit, that sourness, that tartness it gives. Very quenching, thirsting, and well done, you guys. So next time, like I always say, live, learn, and drink.